All right, let's get to it. So in the previous video, I promised to discuss the difference between 4K and 4K UHD. If I access my project settings inside of DaVinci Resolve, and inside of the master project settings, expand my timeline resolution, I'll find that there's quite a few options for resolutions that are above full HD, or 1920 by 1080. The one that's of particular interest to me, it's the one that's 1496 by 2160. This is native 4K. If I scroll closer to the top, directly underneath Full HD, which is 1920 by 1080 square pixels, I'll find 3840-2160, which is similar to that resolution, but narrower. This is Ultra HD. So ultimately, they have very similar sizes, but the direct distinction is that one of them has a 16 by 9 HD ratio, whereas the other one has 256 by 135 ratio. So how did this happen, and what's the distinction? When high definition was first introduced in 1998, the two officially adopted standards were HD Ready, which was 1280 by 720, and Full HD. Not all television screens were able to support Full HD, but at the very least, it could support the 16 by 9 ratio using a square pixel. When 4K sensors first became commercially available in 2003, the Digital Cinema Initiatives, a joint collaboration of major motion picture studios, defined a standard for the new resolution as 4096 by 2160, which is the 256 by 135 aspect ratio, also referred to as 1.9 to 1. Now, television makers and broadcasters who had just recently switched to a 16 by 9 standard were happy to adopt this new resolution, but found it difficult to justify changing the aspect ratio. After all, we had just switched from decades of using a 4 to 3 aspect ratio. So what was decided was that they would show this 4K native footage and simply crop off the pixels on the vertical columns on either side, resulting in a resolution that was 3840 by 2160. This meant that we could continue viewing this 4K footage on full HD screens without seeing black columns on either side. The new standard of 3840 by 2160 was then referred to as 4K UHD TV, as an ultra high definition television, as it comfortably fits four full HD screens. This is why the HD is still in there. It establishes the link between the two 16 by 9 ratios. Usually for marketing reasons, televisions will still be referred to as being 4K when in fact they are 4K UHD. The consumer generally doesn't mind. So in the end, native 4K is seen as a professional production and cinema standard, whereas 4K UHD is primarily used for consumer displays and broadcast standards. It's unlikely that television manufacturers are going to be rolling out a new screen ratio anytime soon, so we'll probably be seeing 16 by 9 versions of every resolution that gets released in the coming decades. Thank you, and until next time!